Do you want your PowerPoint presentations to be interactive? Introducing ClassPoint, an interactive teaching in PowerPoint. I'm Esther Johnny. I'm one of the ClassPoint certified trainers in the Philippines. And also, I have my YouTube channel, my Esther Johnny. As we all know, PowerPoint is a powerful tool. But how can we make it interactive? With the help of ClassPoint, we can make PowerPoint presentations interactive. For example, we have this particular slide. So normally in a Google Meet or Zoom, we tend to ask our students questions. What are the top three mobile apps you frequently use? So how will we make this interactive? So with the help of ClassPoint, we can make that particular slide into an interactive PowerPoint slide, which is one of the features of ClassPoint to make it a word cloud activity. So how will we do it? So we have this slide that we want to make it interactive. All we have to do is skip first and then on the PowerPoint. So you can see here, once you have installed the InkNo class point add-in, there are already a lot of options you can do. So let's select here Word Cloud. And then automatic, this particular slide will become a Word Cloud activity. So all we have to do is to set it up. Click here, if, since we are needing three answers from our students, all we have to do is to click limit the number of submissions and then on the drop down menu or button, yeah, let's click three and then that's it. You have already transformed your slide into an interactive PowerPoint slide. So how will we share it to our students? So just click here, slideshow. And then you can notice here that there is a class code Okay, so what our students simply need to do is to go to classpoint.app so they can search that into Google or simply scan the QR code here, okay, that you will provide. And then once they are in the Google Classpoint app or classpoint.app, they just simply encode the class code which is what you see on the screen. So let's try. Okay, so we have now three participants, Dion, Arvik, and Atan. So we can now start our World Cloud activity. We have three students as we can see here on the upper right side. And then we can start now our activity. So once our students are in the class point, all we have to do as a teacher is to click the World Cloud. And then our students can now enter the answer the questions. What are the top three mobile apps that you frequently use? Alright, so let's see. Let's see the answer. So once all our answers are in, then we can already close the submission. Close the submission. And then we can highlight also the top answers. So you can see here that the Facebook and YouTube are the top two answers of the participants. And we can also insert result as a slide. So this will become a slide. So let's see. Alright. And then we can click also save for review. So you can notice here that the, the result or the answers of the participants converted into a PowerPoint slide. The class point makes the PowerPoint slide interactive. So isn't it amazing? Stay tuned for new videos and webinars featuring class point. Thank you.